Hey guys, it is Monday. I hope that you had a fantastic weekend and I hope that you have set your goal and your sights on having a productive week. Let's not waste our week this week. Let's look at our buzzword for today and we're going to talk about selfishness. And if you're like me, selfishness comes naturally, right? We are all naturally selfish. We are all naturally trying to watch out for ourselves. And I see this more because, you know, I have muscular dystrophy and I'm in a wheelchair. So it's getting around is very difficult. And I see selfishness more because of my situation. People parking in handicapped spots that don't belong there because it's more convenient for them. Uh, when you're shopping at Walmart and there's a wheelchair in the middle of the aisle, you know, people get a little impatient. People, uh, people have cut me off before. People have given me evil looks because I got in their way. I hindered them from doing what they wanted to do as quickly as they wanted to do it. And me, myself, I'm selfish too. There are things that, that I do that display selfishness. So we all need to work on this together. Would you agree with me? Let's look at Philippians chapter 2 and verse 3. It says, Do nothing from selfish ambition or conceit, but in humility count others more significant than yourselves. Let each of you look not only to his own interest, but also to the interest of other. And it goes on to say that by not being selfish, we display the mind of Jesus, the way that Jesus conducted his life. His life, he lived for others. Yes, Jesus took care of his own needs. He ate, he slept, he prayed, he made sure that, that he had stuff that he needed, but he also looked at the needs of others as more superior to his needs. And even so, that he was the Son of God in heaven in all the glorious splendors of heaven and of deity. And he humbled himself and came to earth as a man because he thought more about you than his own self. And this is a great example for us. Nat it's naturally to be selfish, but we as Christians need to be selfless people. Instead of being selfish, we need to be selfless. And by doing so, we display the characteristics of Jesus. We are pleasing to him. We display his characteristics. And we also are the hands and feet of Jesus. The only Jesus that people are going to see physically is through Christians living as Christians. I think it's time, guys, that you and I look for opportunities to be selfless. Maybe don't cut people off in traffic. Maybe let people in. This is my struggle. You're trying to get somewhere. Somebody needs to get over in your lane, but you, you don't want to let them in. Right? Come on. That's one way you let them in. Those are just little basic things. But I want you to really think about your life. Ask yourself this question. Am I selfish? How can I be selfless today? How can I look out for the needs of others above my needs? That is your word for the day. Hope that you have a fantastic day and a great productive week. It's time for me to buzz off. <laughs>